Hello, this is Bobby, and this is Carthy's, North Carolina, my hometown. So jump in and let me show you around. First place we're going to stop at is the Moore County Veterans Memorial. Dedicated on November 11, 2006, to recognize over 150 fallen Moore Countyans that have lost their lives fighting in wars for the past hundred years. Here we are coming up McNeil Street. McNeil Street, if you know it, you would think you were out in the country somewhere. But no, you're in the town of Carthage. We're coming up to the county seat of Moore County. It was established in 1796 where five commissioners were appointed to plot out 69 acres of land that became Carthage, a county seat of Moore County. You know, we have a population of right at 2,400, so we're not real big, but we sure are proud. We're coming up on the Rick Ryan Public Safety Building. This was a new Sheriff's Department Public Safety Building that was dedicated to Rick Ryan as he lost his life December 9, 2011, on duty. Rest in peace, Rick. We miss you, buddy. Now we're coming up to Stoplight, the main stoplight here in Carthage. And we're going to take a left from McNeil on to Monroe. And as we do that, you're going to get to see one of the prettiest sights in Moore County. A Carthage Moore County Courthouse was built in 1922. It was the fourth courthouse built here, and it's still in operation today. We have our tax offices and our dean offices in that building there. Now we're going to continue on McNeil Street, going outside of town, see on both sides of the street. There's beautiful buildings. On the left, that was part of the Tyson Jones Buggy Company. And we'll talk a little bit more about that a little bit later. But you go down and there's all, these old mansions that line the streets of McNeil Street. And they're beautiful, a couple hundred years old, but they're still standing strong. And now we're going to turn around and we're going to go back up McNeil Street, back up and let you see the courthouse from a different angle. We're only one of, I think, five courthouses in North Carolina that are in the center of a road, and we go all the way around the courthouse. To our right is our current courthouse, and as you see, in God we trust, proudly displayed on the building, because that's what we do. We stand with God, and we trust God. We're going to go down, and we want to look at our first mural which is a mural of the water towers that overlooked Carthage up until 2018 when they were torn down because it was just too costly to refurbish them. And then we just go look at some of the buildings around town, some of the old architecture. These buildings are magnificent. Here's another mural being painted on one of the buildings to capture uh, a picture of history, one of our businesses that had been here for years. Here's another mural of Tobacco Farm. Tobacco was Moore County's leading industry for years and years until the government came in and bought out the tobacco allotments and took it over. Here, the next mural we're going to look at is the mural of um, James McCall. James lost his life at 30 years old in World War I. And we have an airstrip here in Moore County, Gillum McConnell Airstrip. And here is a mural, Tyson and Jones Buggy Company. Tyson and Jones Buggy Company 
was in menus from 1850 to 1925 here in Carthage, made buggies and they were shipped all over the United States. Carthage has a museum that is dedicated to the buggies. We have refurbished buggies in there. You can come and visit the museum daily. It's just a nice part of history. And here I am coming back to my house, 207 Bingham Street. That's where I live. I'm proud to call Carthage my hometown. Thank you. God bless. And please, if you like this video, please uh, share it, like it, and subscribe to my channel. Because these videos, I'm doing them for y'all to show you a little bit about where I'm from, where I'm about. But God bless you. Have a great day. Till next time, bye-bye.